All right, we're getting ready now for the C final of the women's 400 IM. Let's set the lanes. Lane one, Rachel Bradford Feldman from St. Andrews Swimming. Two, Jordan Morling, St. Charles Swim Team. Three, Abigail Jones, Nova, Virginia. Four, Marissa Delgado, Cincinnati Marlins. Five, Cameron Curry, Poseidon Swimming. Lane six, Kerry Boone, Nation's Capital. Caroline Wanner from Rappahannock Y Swim Team in seven, and Michaela Herrick for Northern Kentucky Clippers in lane number eight. We got three ladies challenging here in the backstroke leg. We got lane number four, Marissa Delgado, five, Cameron Curry, six, Carrie Boone. So we got now the breaststrokers making their move here in lane number six, Carrie Boone, nation's capital. Make, coming back in it is Marissa Delgado in lane number five, sorry, Cameron Curry in lane number five. Now this is the kind of heat. This is the kind of heat I was talking about. 400 IM lead changing all over the place. Strengths and weaknesses being played on all of these strokes. Looks like it might be Caroline Wanner in lane number six taking over the lead. Now we got Rachel Bradford Feldman in lane one. She's been making a big push this 50 meters and she will have the lead, 350.51. Now those ladies on the other side of the pool probably don't know that she's leading. They probably see some splashes over there. They're not fully aware that Rachel Bradford Feldman is kicking hard. She knows she's in the lead. She doesn't want to let it go. With 50 meters to go, Rachel Bradford Feldman still has the lead. And we got a nice battle for a second. Things four, five, and seven. Rachel Bradford Feldman is coming in. Looks like she's going to win this C final. In 
and St. Andrews Swimming will celebrate this C final win, 458-07 for Rachel Bradford Feldman. They only swim under five minutes in that heat. Almost breaking five minutes, Cameron Curry in lane number five, 50014 for second place.